we still have people, this crew is from New Life Bible Church in Manawa. They're going back, but they were down here for weeks. Uh, many of them are free work. Um, the government of the Bahamas saying come to shore to give Bahamians free work yet. But here these guys are, boy, they got a lot of stuff. Well, it's a lot of them, but they're going back from Manawa. You have to bring a, a, a little um, Belosa truck to get all the stuff that they had. That's how many bikes and stuff they have. You guys come again, we'll do it again, eh? Yeah, we all good. You guys check the dock, it's all empty. All empty. And they're ready to go Jay, back. Jay, give me just a second. Ready to go back to America. Man, I wish they could leave these coolers. I could fill them up with lobsters and stone crab and all them stuff and send them to Nassau to my good friends over there. But they are loaded, loaded, loaded. Um, all hands, many hands, they're on deck here. And um, it's good to see people come by. So we got these guys all the way from Ohio. We thank you guys. Go Buckeyes and um, come again. You guys are leaving on the best day. Uh, the best day they had since they were here from a month ago, January 2nd. Yeah. Hope they had a chance to enjoy some of the avocado, but they're heading back. It's a good look. Um, I really appreciate um, people like these that come down and spend their own money, their own time, their own resources to make avocado better again. That shows you the amount of help that we need. Um, that that church is forever grateful that they had such help, free labor. These guys pay their own ticket down. I see that often, but nobody's coming down to the the churches in Dundas and Murphy Town. I haven't seen anybody um, of that magnitude reached out. I am grateful that uh, they reached out to um, Murphy Town and that. Beautiful building that they built there in Murphy Town. Uh, but to see them come to Manawa and rebuild the church, um, spend one month, I think it was 10 or 15 of them, it's a good look. It shows that people do care. I just wished, and all my wishes, that we had a government that didn't travel to every country in the world in their first time in office, their first two years. Every country that I have never heard of they down there. But then being to Dundas Town and Murphy Town and spend a day there yet. They pass through and look at a couple of little shingles that um, they put on the ground there and they're gone. But to spend some quality time. I think the only minister that spent a two three days there that was record was Clay Sweeting. And amazingly, we are grateful for, for just the speed bumps being moved of Marshall. It, it, it reminds you of your, um, how your brain works where everybody keep going PLP and f and m Your condition, your mind is conditioned. An example of that is the speed bumps that were on the road in Marshall for over three years. That's the speed bumps are being removed for three days. But every time I get to the position where the speed bump was, I automatically hit the brakes. They said, ah, something ain't right here. But you have to get your mind programmed to know that the speed bumps are no more. Um, boy, I wish we could get our mind programmed for the FNM and the PLP to say that there are no, no more and none of the robbing of the treasury. We're, we're probably the only country that pays tax. What? How could it be that we pay what? And no government, the FNM, for four years, then won't talk about that. The PLP that brought what up, then won't talk about that. Who? What, why, when, all them conjunction that you have to watch your function. What is going on with the VAT money? Why can nobody, all the members of parliament there,
can tell the Bahamian people what is going on with that money. And Bahamians are not asking that question. They're willingly and unwillingly paying for what? But they don't want to ask what and how much of that money has been collected. What are y'all doing with it? Only Kai, y'all don't lock me up. I just have a right to ask. Where's the VAT money? Is that a crime to ask that when I'm paying it? I gotta switch back to the something that don't get me locked up. Beach. But I wanna know. All these years, how much VAT money is being collected and who and what you're doing with it. That's what I wanna know. This is early. It's early morning. Beautiful day. Tomorrow, it would not be so beautiful. Kai cares. That's why he's there at the ferries, wondering what the hell y'all doing, and what the hell did y'all did, and what the hell y'all gonna do with our what money? Lord help us. We need Jesus. Jesus needs to step in.